A very special good morning to all of you that have joined us on our morning devotions. Greetings to our senior pastor, Reverend Bishop Anthony Roberts and Sister Angela Roberts. I am Reverend Julian James, an assistant pastor of Revival Time Assembly of number one St. Vincent Street in San Fernando. This week, our subject will be time, T-I-M-E, time. Someone has said, the way to describe time is to explain it as a movement that represent the past, the present, and the future. What an important gift given to man by God. Something from the very beginning of time to use to manage our lives constructively. As believers, we could look back. How did we manage our time? in the past. Question, how much time did we spend with and for God? Can we say like a songwriter, wasted years spent so foolish? But Philippians 3.13 says, but I count not myself to have apprehended. But this one thing I do, forgetting those things which are behind and reaching forth unto those things which are before. Paul seems to be telling us don't waste any more time. Our past time is former. We must not dwell on it. Time is a movement, constantly going forward, reminding us only one life will soon be passed. Only what is done for Christ will last. What have you done with your time? Have you taken the time to think that time is something that we will have to give account to God for? We will have to tell God something about how we spent it. Time goes with our life. Time goes with our season. Time goes with our very existence, what are we doing with our time? Now that we have come to this realization how important time is, I believe as children of God, we are going to appreciate the value of God's time in our life. Let us pray. Father, we thank you for this day and for bringing us this consciousness of how valuable our time is. You have given us this precious gift. May we find the time to use this time to do something to advance your kingdom, to bring glory to your name, to see men and women surrender their lives and realize the time in which they are living. Father, we thank you for another day and time like this. In Jesus' name, amen. See you tomorrow when we deal with the subject of present time. God bless you.